So get you some cow's milk so you can strengthen up them bones. Do you drink lactate, Dion? I don't know what you're talking about. What? Lactate? It's a lot more shit with calcium than milk. What else? Fuck what else milk. you take what are what are you taking to get that vitamin D? I mean C <laughs> calcium in your system. <laughs> you're retarded. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> like really, like what are you talking about? This is why you said your bones was brittle. So I'm saying, what are you doing to make them strong? Oh, and you, and shit. as you are aging, yo, are you my chiropractor? <laughs> you my doctor? <laughs> I mean, you want to you want to know my medical history right now? Yes, I you love you about? with all my heart. So Jesus I want to make Christ. sure that you're as healthy as possible because we know men don't like to take care of themselves in there as they get older. Brittle. With Most men. Bones. men don't like to take care of themselves. Yeah, no. Yo, that's the craziest shit like I've ever heard. In my they life. don't like to go to the doctor. They don't like. That's why. Yeah. That's why the life expectancy for men is lower than women. Nah, we be trying to get away from y'all faster. Maybe. That's what the fuck we be doing. <laughs> but it is got though, shit to do with the doctor. If you look it up, it's to if you die. Look it up. It's to die before you for peace. What, <laughs> nigga? Look, there I go with the first one. Please dismiss it. Shit. You funny. Be alone. <laughs> so if I got to do what I got to do to make sure <sighs> your bones get stronger, I'm sending you an Instacart with some cow's milk. All right. You can keep that shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, y'all. Welcome to back. the Bumping Heads podcast. I'm your chesty bestie, Persephone, and I'm joined with my nearest and dearest. Say hello to the fam, <laughs> Dion DC Curry. What's up, man? Kenny Jones. What's the deal? Hey, Martini yo. Bellini. What's up, y'all? All right, show. So, um, I guess I'm the elephant in the room. <laughs> As, Maybe in more ways than one. As but the damn show. <laughs> <laughs> what, what's them ways? So I was I was under I was under the impression we go. that Here we, we go. were wearing costumes today. Here we go. And so when the yeah. folks showed up. I was under I, the impression that it was Halloween themed. It was a theme. Well it you was said a th- Oh, Costume. Shit. Here we go. We should have. So it was a this theme. Halloween so, shirts on or hocus he pocus. He stated shirts on. everybody did the Costume. homework. You just did extra credit and shit. Y'all look well, good. No. Y'all look good though. Thank you, but don't Thank say you. you didn't say costume because when you walked in, you said that was your costume. Ooh. You you just you want to do this, huh? Hey, we in it. <laughs> So I'm not gonna be sitting here embarrassed by myself. You know? I, I You're know not embarrassed. I know what she wants. She is not embarrassed. I know what she wants. She loves how she, she looks. Just you guys, the bait. No. <laughs> she just wants to see if I was gonna catch it. Let me catch it. Though. Look at the boobs. Oh my goodness. Yeah. New. Nope. Go out back. This is incredible. Don't do that. That's no what more. I want to do. Don't do that no more. I will stand up and it'll be Elastigirl. a disaster. Elasta girl. <laughs> <laughs> Dion came as a, yo. What are you? Third. What, no, nah, what he just, what he come just as? Just delete a, all that right there. No, nope, right. do not. Came just as a delete ashy. all of that. D N D. Dion came as an ashy teenager for Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying not to laugh too hard, so I don't spill this Fight drink, back, bro. <laughs> <laughs> She roasted. 
Oh. God, I'm kidding. Okay. See, because if I go, then everybody gonna be talking about why I went so hard. No, they not. Nice. You got jokes. Let them fly. Mm-mm. An ashy teen. So, so what am if he an ashy teen? Then what am I? Oh my god. Oh shit. No. <laughs> Stephanie, tell him. What's I the first? don't. <laughs> this not my thing. That's I wasn't roasting so nobody. Funny. I'm just over here trying to see clearly <laughs> through this mask. I told you to open your eyes wide. I don't know how she fought crime in this. <laughs> <laughs> and they put him on fast too. It'd be like the camera went away, and they're like. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I'm over here like That's why she's a superhero <laughs> she And said, I'm not I don't know First of all she didn't have any eyelashes <laughs> so First of all I'm sure Thick credibles slide it down. Thick credibles <laughs> Thick credible Miss <laughs> Thick credible God <laughs> damn that shit hot Tit credible <laughs> <laughs> Please get me out of here You're I right. am <laughs> Mrs. Tit credible Okay no, What is wrong with you today I drank a five hour energy Did you Damn. Why? Because <laughs> it has stuff to do. How many hours oh, you need? Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, it's yeah, like. This is Tick Credible. Tick Credible. Tick Credible? Tick Credible. Titty Credibles? No. Tick Credible. Anyway. I must have had some before we got. Listen. I just told you what I had. I just. I was laughing too hard right now. I just needed a second. For sure. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> okay. Now that that's done. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> <She's all. laughs> Damn it. I Ooh. knew that one go last. You know what? Your eyes ever get hot? What? Absolutely. <laughs> Something like that. Yo, <laughs> you tripping. It's like my eyes sweating, but I'm not crying. Okay. What? My eyes, eyes are sweating. I have literal sweat around my eyes, <laughs> but I'm not crying. No more five hour energy for your ass. That is not true. You need. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk to me like that. <laughs> All right, you ready? Like Mrs. Tick nine minutes ago. <laughs> nine minutes ago. All right. How you feel about? <laughs> Big booties, little booties, middle-sized booties, all of them shaking and popping and flopping and clapping. How you feel about twerking? I don't know. I don't really have no opinion on twerking. It's cool, I guess. <laughs> you a <What> lie. You... <laughs> right. Like, what? what? Do you think? You like, lie. when you see you see a woman on the internet, she's twerking. What are your, what are your automatic thoughts? What do you think of it? What do you think? Uh, depend on who doing it. Do you want your girl twerking on IG on socials? You, you want her posting videos of herself twerking? Uh, probably not. Why not? <laughs> uh, well, I mean, I damn, or do I? Huh? Shit, I. Never thought about it like that. I have never thought about it like that. Mm -hmm. But I That's guess the, point. I guess my initial answer is, nah, I wouldn't. But then I don't even know why I'm saying, nah, I wouldn't. Like, because when I do see it, I do like it. Be because. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe, maybe I don't want nobody else to see my girl do it. I don't know, but. That. Right. Okay. Because look, twerking is a we're not gonna act like it's not a sexual dance, especially depending on who's doing it and how good they are. It originated in the motherland though. Okay. For sure. <clears throat> For sure. I mean listen, twerking just got to mainstream ten years ago, but we've been doing that shit forever. Yeah. All right. Like it was well this in, is true. in our community, well, in LA it was popping before twerking. Niggas was right. doing that in the nineties. Mm -hmm. Clown dance and all that whole movement. People was popping. Dudes was, oh. dudes was popping. Oh. oh, girls was popping in the club. The splits. Yeah. For sure. You know. Um, Don't stop. Drop that. Let me see it. Oh, yeah. Slamming on the pop. That's mm -hmm. like prime twerking. Twerking. Uh, Too loud crew. How do y'all yeah. feel about it? How does, when you twerk, how does it make you feel? Oh, I love it. It's very liberating. <laughs> I love it. I do. I talk love to twerk. You, you talk, love to talk your shit. Yeah. I love it. Uh, do I believe that there's 
a time and a place for it? Absolutely. Um, What's the time and a place? I mean, when I'm with my homegirls and we all at the house, mm-hmm. you know, and we just going at it. Yeah, that's a time to do it. So not public? At the club. If we're at the club on the dance floor, I'm fucking it up. <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, but of course, I'm not going to be like, you know, you know, and. In a bank, you post some little clips. it up, you know. No, got, I'm joking. No, yeah, got some clips. It's a time and a place for twerking. Um, now I do. I, I'm pro- I'm mindful of what angle I'm gonna be posting of, of a twerk. <laughs> if you have the straight back and you just see the the cheeks going like mm-hmm. separating, the, that is pretty intense. I don't think that I've posted anything <laughs> like that. We might give a side, you know, side jiggle or something, but. Usually the straight back angle of the twerk is pretty, uh-huh. pretty tough. Yeah, I usually get yours from the side angle. Cause you could see you some chicks, you could see the print mm-hmm. and everything from the if she's really spreading her cheeks wide. So it's like, <laughs> oh, <laughs> like woo. I don't see nothing wrong okay. with that. You know, so yes, it is a very sexual dance, like you were saying, because it gets, I think it probably gets folks aroused for sure. Mm-hmm. Do you feel, and, and you feel people, empowered? Uh, <laughs> I enjoy it. I just, I like doing it. It's fun. Mm-hmm. Um, I try not to think too deep into it. Um, we've been doing that since before I became an adult. So it's like, I think, I think... In mainstream, I think people try to say, like, oh, when is this going to be over? Like, when is this twerking phase going to be over? I don't think it's ever going to be over because people like to see it and people like to do it. And they have fun doing it. So as much as people try to shame, especially black people, because let me go into it. Do you think? We'll get shamed for twerking. And then you have... uh, what was her name? Lexi Pantera mm-hmm. come out and it's she old. she giving twerking classes and she's praised or um nasty nasty Nas. Nas. nasty Nas? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. She's doing teaching twerk classes. Teaching teaching twerk classes around and the world. Millions of views and everybody's like, yes, yes, yes. But then you get Apple Watts and they're like when are these black girls gonna stop doing X, Y, and Z? Yeah, Apple Watch me. Oh. <laughs> she okay, she uh, the difference uh. is there a difference in body types with these two? Yes, Nasty Nas more bodied up, right? Um, I mean, no, 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 no. Nasty Apple Nas, Watch, sorry, Apple Watch more yeah. bodied up. Way, I way think more that body. that definitely has to do with it too. Is like. Cause I used to get like dress coded cause I, I was developed early and then like, I kind of like grew into, you know, whatever, but yeah, like I would wear the same stuff or it'll be the same thing. And if the chick is like, got a, like a juicy booty or, mm-hmm. you know, like that definitely, I feel like makes people react differently. Yeah. Well, but okay. I mean, this was our stuff. Like it's, it's cause, ours. Al- yeah. so. cause Apple Watch is black. Uh-huh. And the other two yeah. chicks are. Are not. Are not. Um, <laughs> I think they're Latin or something. Uh, yeah. Really? I thought they were. Latin. Well, no, the nasty whatever her shit. She's like Latin or oh, okay. some shit. Okay. I thought and that so first one was a white girl. What was her? Lexi Pinter. Mm-hmm. I, I don't know. I don't know who that is. Yeah. Oh, you don't? Mm. She, she's okay. kind of. That's kind of old school now, but. Yeah. I don't know she, who that is. She was. She was. She was <laughs> very <laughs> thin. She was very thin, but she had oh, yeah. a little jiggle. Well, you know, I mean, like, look, like everything else, when they when they take it from us, it's like a new phenomenon. Now yeah. it's yeah. now it's from now it's accepted. Now it's mm-hmm. like what the fuck. If no. niggas if niggas know they if y'all know y'all could have been teaching twerk classes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh man, y'all would have did that shit thirty years. Right, ago. right. But and we have we the, I'm sure we have. I, I mean, I've taken some twerk classes, but they That's weren't right. publicized yeah. the way that. You know, so it just, I feel like we're going to continue to do it because I think we're coming into this. Look, I don't care what you think. Like, this is what we've been doing. It's part of our culture. And and you guys can come in and try to, you know, turn it into, oh, we created this. You know, let me teach you how to do X, Y, and Z. And I can't, I can't fault our community for being part of that, 
issue too, because sometimes it's like, you know, when other people will start twerking, it'll be mediocre and, you know, the black is like, yes, oh my God. And it's <laughs> mediocre, but then, yeah. you know, it's expected that we could do it like really good. So, you it's know. Like, oh, well, she's like, she, of course she can, oh. right? Okay. You got people like artists like Meg that are like, it's, it's, I feel mm-hmm. like, yeah, you know, she's normalizing it for sure. Mm-hmm. But they even try to, they try to shame her and say, you know, well, is that all she can do? I don't want to go to a show if that's all she can do. But the thing is, she's rapping too. <laughs> so she's performing. So yes, yeah, she's twerking, but that's Qu- what people, people que- want to see that. Question, dude, does she rap better? Or does she twerk better? Mm, Meg is a really good rapper. That's not what I asked you. Oh, we talking about Meg? Does she I rap think better or she is. I think it's even. Better? I think she's she's could be because I knew about her before so, she became okay. mainstream, and her freestyles and stuff freestyles before she became cold. mainstream. I was like, oh, yes, okay, she's pretty talented. So I I, think I, it's I even. definitely I think, rap think it's she twerks. I think it's even. I think she I would say even even because she has a great. I twerk. think she twerks better. Mm-hmm. Meg is dope. I love what she's doing for you, for us. I think she twerks better. And you know, this was a point of contention in one of my old like situationships or whatever. I, I'm not gonna act like I want my girl going around twerking all over the place because mm-hmm. I don't. Yeah. But like you said, there is a time and a place for it. Mm-hmm. My favorite word lately is tact. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Being tactical, doing shit. Yeah. With mm. tact. <laughs> yeah. The so, twerk. Yeah. Yes. Like, come on. Let's you always show girls. You you always show girls. You fucking up. You having a good time. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like it's a part of our culture. I'm not going to yeah. um, deny that. Mm-hmm. Like I said, we grew we grew up and it was the right there. Um, the girl I used to date, she was an artist, and she used to post a lot of twerking stuff. So my thing was like, okay, yeah, that's a part of you, mm-hmm. but. Do you want to be known for your twerking mm-hmm. or do you want to be known for your artistry? Do you want to be known for doing other kind of dances, a whole routine choreography? Mm-hmm. You want to be known for your singing, for your rapping, for your videos, or do you want to be known for twerking? <sighs> Somebody, Pierre, pointed out, he said, now once did you say that you twerk for your man <laughs> in that? I know y'all get a dude that twerking just go all out the window, huh? No, it don't. <laughs> oh. No, it don't. <laughs> It's not. You gonna you gonna twerk Listen, with your girls? You okay. not gonna twerk on your man? I, I gotta I'll twerk gotta, my man, but I be story. naked when I'm twerking. The on them. That's, that's the that's difference. Not, we that's not having gonna, sex. I will that's say not the dancing and the the dancing and the grinding on them goes out the window. Usually, if I have a man, it's like I'm not. I I want more of that in my relationships in the future, <laughs> where I just like we be in the kitchen and I just be you know. But I don't dance a lot with them. But as far as like twerking and making it clap in the in a sack. Yeah, we own doing that. <laughs> you know, man. I that did. I definitely... twerked. I was in a relationship <laughs> with this dude, and I twerked for him. He had all the ones. He had three hundred dollars in ones. All the ones. And I, we was, in, we was in, we was in a hotel. We was just, just our mm-hmm. hotel room. Mm-hmm. And so I put on a little show. I was twerking. He was making it rain on me. Do you know this what? man? Took the money back. Bitch. She did not let me keep it. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Where do you find I ain't doing it no more. <laughs> <laughs> and it was a good tour. He was loving it too. Wow. I'm like, oh, you into it. You loving this. I'm like, oh, keep throwing them. I'm like, mm, 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 mm. <laughs> All on his lap and a little thong, you know. Crazy, you know, you could see like the little wait. This is my you, was, you was, this is my you was dating. What, what? He was my boyfriend. What did he, so, girl, he got up and started? Picking I'm trying to figure out. I'm trying to figure out. Hold on, and I was um, picking him up too because I thought he was scooping him up. I mean, you know, like security doing a strip club, you know, they be trying to, <laughs> yes, <laughs> trying to yes, nigga. Scoop it up. Yes, nigga, he this, took the so. money back that you, yes, we, we scooped it up together, and he was like, Oh, yeah, thank you, excuse me. What do you mean? Thank you. Thank you for what? <laughs> the dance. Oh, no, thank you for the money. What you mean? <laughs> no, thank you for the money. <laughs> he yeah, was like, oh, deep. no, like. I mean, we was role playing for real. He was like, no, I'm real. keeping it. I thought we was just role playing. 
<laughs> you thought it. this physical exhaustion of a twerk? <laughs> I mean, I was on the bed, like upside down, you know, hands on the floor, legs on the no, bed. No, I just see that. Oh, yeah, y'all, dating not. For, for, y'all dating and you do that. You, you expect. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not taking the money back. You're not taking the money back. The money back. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. He's he like, took the Yo, money back. Why did you even throw it if you didn't I, that's have what it? That's what I said. Give? I said you could have got a bubble gun and just shot <laughs> bubbles in the air if that's what we was doing. Like, don't you guys? <laughs> did you guys have a real discussion about this? Yes. <laughs> we had a money gun. <laughs> you guys, what did he say? He was like, "Oh no!" Like, I thought we was role playing. How much longer were y'all together after that? Not that much longer. Uh, yeah, How I much bet. longer y'all in that room after that? <laughs> she said, you think I this physical exhaustion? <laughs> Look, I, I ate an edible after that. Got fucked up. Had to go in it with all them dollars. That's tough. Can you imagine? You scooping up the dollars. He's helping. <laughs> I didn't know he was helping for himself. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <Oof>. <laughs> Stephanie, you don't really, you've met some, oof. Some yes. jokers, some winners, all <laughs> damn, some clowns. Yeah, that was that was that was some bozos. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Let's uh, let's Burn let's, my let's, lip on that. let's bring it up. <laughs> let's let's bring it up a little bit. Okay, we gonna, I'm gonna ch- totally change the tone. Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> Let's let's talk about some Halloween stuff. You know what I'm saying? Man. Oh, I, why was I about to go like this? <laughs> uh huh. That is not. <laughs> that ain't it. Uh, no. Halloween. So what? What are? What's y'all favorite scary movie? <laughs> when you say scary, like, do it have to be like horror film at night and shit, or can it be like zombies? Horror film. What you, what you mean? I'll like zombies. I don't like it. horror genre, bro. <laughs> horror. That's whatever horror. is horror. Right. I whatever is horror. Zombies fit into horror and sci-fi, but no, train no. to abuse zombies. Killer zombies, which I mean most of the time, mm. killer zombies are horror. Yeah. All right, these are killer zombies. If it's just like back walking the, dead, nah. Hell. Yeah, if it's just walking nah, dead, nah, nah, then nah, nah, maybe nah, nah, you know. Nah. nah. But them nigga, them them zombies that. Fucking run like, like Usain Bolt and shit. And, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Okay, so it's called Train to Busan. Now you're gonna have to read because unless you speak Chinese, but oh. you're gonna have to read the subtitles, but it's worth it. I swear to God. The story is dope. The I don't know if I want to read subtitles on a scary movie. I mean, I didn't either, bro, but I because mean a scary movie, movie, but it's think, good. Bro, we think watched, uh, because a scary movie we you're it's all visual. You're trying to be scared. Like, yeah. You ain't got time to be trying to interpret. What God damn, how long it take you to read the subtitle? It's only one sentence at a time. You know, <laughs> it takes me a millisecond to read the we subtitle. Yeah, yeah. It's like boom. I can do it. I can. I, it's I, not I, that I can do it. how long it takes, nigga. We all know I read very well. It's not that. I just. <laughs> I get what you're saying. You you want to be more immersed in what's going on versus trying to read because then I'm gonna interpret. Cause when I'm watching a scary movie, like let's, most movies don't scare me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Number one, like especially all your classic horror films, none of them shit scare me. Except maybe the Exorcist a little bit, but that's only because it's like I don't get afraid from shit that's like Jason, Michael Myers, Freddy. Like oh, these are tangible things. Mm-hmm. Like first mm-hmm. off, Michael Myers and Jason ain't catching me. I don't give a fuck <laughs> what them movies be on. Okay. Them niggas we walking two miles an hour. I'm not getting caught by them. Hey, but it, no, no matter when you turned around, don't turn back around. They was like right they there. Right there. That's yeah. some bullshit. Yeah, and but I that's, know it's, that's just they powers. See, no, but no. See, I know that's bullshit. And I'm like, well, oh, it's just for the movie. But what if it really happened? No. Every time you turned around, he was just so right there it? walking slow. So, so yours is it more gotta like, be like supernatural? Yeah, so like my favorite shit is The Conjuring. Demons. My favorite shit is The Conjuring. The whole Conjuring universe, but particularly the actual Conjuring movies. Um, that's because, like, you know, we don't know if that shit... Oh, you that sometimes it, it be saying, like... <laughs> no, the actual... Some of that stuff be saying based on a true story. Which, I mean, I you know, that's that some shit. bullshit, too. That's but bullshit. Well, the parts that are true are I'm probably just saying, the ones look, that... I'm just saying, look, they was we, in the church. We, we all in here have said that we've had some form of sleep paralysis mm-hmm. and shit. Mm-hmm. Look, 
some of that shit is supernatural to me, my nigga. I don't care what y'all talking about. <laughs> mm-hmm. So the the conjuring is is like what is it called? Ast uh, astro surfing. That's oh, I know that, what you're talking about. Um, is that that's the conjuring? Right? No, no, no. It's just like demonic possession, shit like that. But don't they like go to sleep? And am I thinking of something different? I think when so. they go, oh. Huh? Astro projection. Astro projection. Yeah, I was about to say astro glide. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck. (laughs) Yo ass. Astro gliding. (laughs) Well, what's your favorite scary movie though? Astro. I like The Conjuring. What's your shit? What am I thinking of? If that's not. Yeah, I don't. I thought that was um, The Conjuring. The Conjuring is the one with the the family. And then it, it involves that doll. Was it Annabelle later on? Yeah, that's it's all the same oh, universe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What am I thinking of? Do y'all know what I'm talking about? When mm-hmm. he has to go get his son's like astral projection from the devil. Uh, like, insidious. Insidious. I'm thinking of Insidious. Okay, my bad. Insidious. I've never seen that one. I okay. I've seen that. Hey, scary. you gotta watch. You gotta watch Insidious. It's scary. It's decent. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You like scary I don't movies? Really like. Scary stuff. <laughs> Yo, she is a scary ass nigga yeah. though. Yeah. Uh, you know, I've, a lot of girls don't even Whatever like watching that means, scary movies. I don't take offense to that. I love scary movies. I'll watch that's American weird. Horror Story. I'll watch that, but um, oh. that's yeah. that ain't really scary. That's, that's the true. name. Is scary. Some of it is. I'll watch it, but it had it Growing was way up? later. Grown I mean, Up was very just oh, okay. That was that a whole one. scene. Hotel was. The movie that scared the shit out of me as a child was It. It scared the fuck out of me. Like, really? Yes. That was like my, that was like my. Niggas be scared of clowns, though. (laughs) Fuck a clown. I don't understand. (laughs) Niggas not always in the sewer. Maybe it's because of, um, Gacy. They're they're playing on people's fear of clowns. The mm-hmm. it is not a clown, really. He's from a f- another no, fucking planet. No, <laughs> but he dressed as a clown. Right, you're playing on people's fear of clowns. So if you're afraid of it, it's because you're afraid hey, of clowns. But there was a serial killer that was a clown. I didn't Gacy, like the whole... he was a clown. It wasn't even that he was a <laughs> clown. It, he came out. Yes, of his I think it's John Wayne Gacy. Bathroom. I'm like, he was a clown. Oh, he's coming. Let me John hurry up. Wayne, I used Gacy. to hurry up in the bathroom like. <laughs> <laughs> Like he's gonna come out of the drain. Like, why did they make that? Can like cut clowns, but coming out of the drain, I'm like. Ooh. So every time you went to the t- the yes! sink, it's was... like, <laughs> hurry up and get out of here, John, John Wayne Gacy. Gacy. Yeah, he was the he was a killer clown. No, but he used to that, kill. I think he used to kill what? boys and store them in the floorboards of his house. When was this? I'm sorry, eighties maybe. What year, what year 80s was this? I think yeah, I think it was in the eighties. He used right, to. Too young. He was like he would like contract, and and correct me if I'm wrong. He would use them as like contractors, like, um, to to do. I thought you had the story up. Um, and then he would like he would kill them and store them, in the floorboards of the house. A nigga come up. And he was, but he was big. He was a a big guy, but he dressed as a clown. It's, Man, it's fuck him. Crazy. I think he killed like. <laughs> 30, 30 people, maybe? The bigger they are, the harder they fall. He better have a strap. <laughs> Fuck all that shit. Yeah. <laughs> he probably caught him off guard. I don't know. How many, how many people did John Wayne get to kill? You did. You wasn't scared of Freddy Cougar? It's oh, a little different because it's like, damn, I'm going to sleep. Like, he might yeah, get a nigga. Freddy was, mm-hmm. Freddy in, your, was scared. in your nightmares. But, nah, them other ones. Freddy was on Elm Street. Did you, no. <laughs> did you watch it? No. You didn't watch it? No. I know of him. No, I know. Like, I'm like, girls are really scary though, bro. I had no idea. Like chicks, you seven out of ten. You can put a scary movie on, well, and they walk out the room. My mom, my my parents, and my family. I feel like they babied me, like in that way. Like, like when I would come over, they would make my cousins like change the channel from whatever else they. Were. I was watching. We, I'm watching Barney. I'm watching SpongeBob. I'm watching like light, you know, feel good stuff all the time. So mm-hmm. now I'm just like. Why would I want to feel fear, like voluntarily bring that feeling on myself? Like, no, I don't want to f- mm. be scared. Gacy <laughs> killed thirty three people, by the way. Hey, yes. So, who? Yeah, Gacy, the, 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 the guy who was just the talking clown. about the, the clown killer. Okay, he killed yeah. thirty three people. So mm. I could see some people's fears staring from that because that's the eighties. So and that was really, really like publicized. You know, that was around the time that serial killers were just like. 
highly publicized like that. Well, my re- I've always had a great relationship with clowns. Shout out to Tommy the Clown. <laughs> Funny, I like Tommy the Clown. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> 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 Where did you learn that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, you didn't grow up in LA. Yeah, I forgot y'all here. Uh, I've seen that dance. My uh, th- th- y'all about to look at me like I'm crazy. What? Yep. <laughs> my the movie that I fear the most, a lot of people say it was black. <laughs> <laughs> Look at old shit, black and white. No, 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 no. Um, damn, and I just lost the name of it that fast. Oh, the shit! I have never forgot the name of this movie. This is but the they had multiple place. of them. They made like seven of them. Um, and no, it's not Saw. It's not the Rage Carry. No. The what? The Rage Carry. Oh, that was like oh, Ryan Carrie? 13? That's no, no, no. about seven of them. No, it was, it was the... It's about 11 of them. I'll, I'll tell you why <laughs> while, it's, while it's trying to compute in my mind the name of the seven damn more. movie. Um, I never saw the preview for it. And my boyfriend at the time took me to see it. I didn't know what I was watching. I thought what I was watching was a true story and true footage. Um, Blair Witch Project? No. Paranormal activity. Paranormal activity. The mm. first one. The first one. Only the first one. The rest of them, they ain't, they ain't do nothing to me. But the only reason why the first one got me, and it didn't get me till two months later. Because you thought it was real. Well, that was one. But I was laying in my bed, asleep, in my apartment, alone. All my windows were closed. No air conditioner. I don't even think I had air conditioner. Um, the heater wasn't on. It was still air in my house. And my blinds just started moving like clack, 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 clack. And it woke me up. It was the middle of the night and it woke me up. And I'm like, what the fuck? Bro. I'm sure there was a perfectly I, logical explanation that is, there for There was it. no logical explanation for why wind. my blinds started. No, there was no wind in my house. Obviously, it was no, if the blinds were moving. That is what be scaring no. you. If I creep up on you and you don't hear me or something, and then... I, <laughs> no, oh, it was, it was not was windy. <laughs> it was no wind in my house. Okay, I'm telling so you. it was a ghost? Yes. <laughs> you still, you're standing by the... You I'm standing it? by it. <laughs> it was the blinds I ghost. I did not sleep in my room for two hours. Months, I slept in my <laughs> living room and my TV was on the floor. I so to watch it like I that. I slept in front of my TV. Literally, know. the you're TV like, was like where this shit like table that. is. I slept in front of the TV for two months, <sighs> and I thought about paranormal activity. And there was one specific part that freaked me the hell out. This specific part was there's a part in the movie where he's like. He hears a noise and he's going upstairs. He puts powder down and there's this like roar, but the powder, there's footsteps, there's hooves as the footsteps. But the roar was just so frightening to me because it was so, so loud. It was just too, uh, evil. Like- it was the, is the worst sound that I feel like I've ever heard. I don't think I've heard any sound more frightening than that. <laughs> that it just sounded like we need to know like who a, did the scream a for a cold parents. ass <laughs> demon, like yeah. with hooves. So I got like this Baphomet type of image <laughs> as you know, and then they like pulling the people by their feet, like oh, ah. <laughs> <laughs> it freaked me out. That's nah. the only movie. The only movie that's ever freaked me out. As a child, the only thing that we wouldn't do as a child is we would not say Candyman in front of the mirror oh, yeah. in the bathroom with the lights off that and the door closed. Is. They tried to do that to us once, me and my cousins. And instead of just turning the light on, like common sense would tell you to do, we screaming. In the we dark. screaming, banging on the door. <laughs> And they screaming Candyman from outside of the door. And we're like, ah! Ah! What was the other one? Bloody Mary. Bloody, Bloody Mary. Mary. Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. I was scared. Mary. Bloody Mary. <laughs> For sure. Bloody, uh, for don't sure. say that in here. What you doing? You leaving in the bathroom ah, in what front are you of the mirror. I don't oh, knock it over. Yeah, not don't say that here. Get on the- I'm telling you. 
Bye. <laughs> you are not scared of Bloody what? Mary. Yes, she is. Oh, she Do is. not say Bloody Mary Ooh. here. I'm going to say Bloody Mary in every mirror in Mary your house before stuff. I leave today. She's going to get you. Because you, you she summoned don't. her. Bet you she don't. Wait, DC, what's your favorite shit? The Chinese uh, one, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. But, nigga, w- one that we would know. <laughs> Which one you at least like? I like Paranormal. I didn't even, um, I forgot all about those. And all of those are actually good. You said you don't like the first one? No, the, the first one is the only one that scared me. Oh. Uh, but a lot of people were like, what was that? That was horrible. And I'm like. Yeah, no, nah, that, that shit was pretty good, me too. Out. But Freddy was kind of creepy, too, though. Because in your dreams type shit is like, nigga, that's cheating almost. He, that's definitely like, cheating. That's mm-hmm. cheating, bro. And he wouldn't die so, even if you set him on fire. Yeah. He got like <laughs> he was already he got like ten up. right he got like ten Elm Elm Streets so. probably more so, because I they mean, start going into Freddy versus Jason yeah, and I mean the it's, the big three back. the big three each got like ten over ten Michael Myers Jason and <laughs> nigga they just mm-hmm. came out with another Halloween <laughs> oh yeah Jamie Lee Curtis like is a great grandmother uh, yeah th- still chop trying to kill Michael Myers. Okay. <laughs> They're definitely gonna kill her in this one. I already know this. She I has haven't to. seen it, but they are definitely. My gonna thing kill is, her how the this. fuck Michael Myers just killing everybody? The nigga came out the house and killed thirty <laughs> firemen, but he can't get Jamie Lee Curtis. <laughs> right, come on, dog. Doesn't he have some type of special <laughs> connection to her? Yeah, look, I don't know. I think they brother and sister. I thought it was he, good. It was there. There was one. Where they showed him like in the mental institution. Did you guys see that? That was one? the one where they went back to him as a child. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I thought that one that was one, like one of the best ones. That one dope. Yeah. That one dope. Yeah. Y'all got to see that one if you haven't seen that one. That was really good. Yeah. I like the Amityville Horror. Amityville Horror was pretty That's good. with, uh, I can't think of his name. Dude that played Deadpool. Yeah. Ryan, yeah. Ryan yeah. 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 Is that his name? Right. Ryan, Ryan Reynolds. Mm-hmm. Ryan Reynolds. That right. shit was good. Amityville Horror is good. That took a turn that I, he didn't want to turn into the killer <laughs> of shit. Yeah. Also, that shit was good. That shit was good. What's that one? Is is the conjuring, is, is the conjuring the one where they're, they, um, it's this being where they're like filming and the dad, oh, maybe that might be, that might be Amity. No. There's one where there's this being that controls the children. They film it, and mm. then... Yeah, the uh, Conjuring 2. Like, yeah, that's the one? Of, oh, uh, yeah. Uh, the, the kids were getting possessed. The kids got possessed by this being, and then, yeah. Mm. They would film it, but they would they would show like how they were going to die. Like One was in the pool. The other were like, hanging from a tree. From a tree, yeah. like the whole family. <laughs> yeah, that one, that one was crazy. Yeah, that was that was, that was, that was good. <laughs> I mean, part of it too is like I'm 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 intrigued at how they do it. Like, mm-hmm. how, you know, think about being on set and you making a scary movie. Like, yeah, that'd be just, dope. What's the name? Was freaked out. Um, who didn't want to do the the movie after she saw it? I think it was Silence of the Lambs. Clarice. You remember Silence of the Lambs? Mm-hmm. The, uh-huh. The one so the one who played her mouth, right, or something. Like mm-hmm. for the, for the cover. That's the cover. That's yeah. The cover. I thought that that movie was really good. Silence of the Lambs. You said that was wow. some freaky shit. She didn't. That wasn't really movie. scary. It was. That was more. So? No, nah, that was more thriller. Yeah, thriller. That was more like a thriller. Oh, that was he scary. Was just, you know, he was crazy. He was cunning, but like, yes. yeah. You can't, you, you can't. Them you can't whoop man. Anthony Hopkins old ass. <laughs> what? You can't whoop. Wasn't that old? That you can't whoop man, Anthony like Hopkins old ass. Oh no, for sure Anthony would have got it. He he got it. Yeah. Had his liver with some fava beans. And it's love. Uh, but he was he was I'm in not. jail in that one though. <laughs> it was the other dude he was helping. The the, right, the the detective Chase. He would like. Tuck it. The, uh, he would be naked and it tuck it on the skin. and be yeah. posing in the <laughs> mirror. You know, with some weird, oh, like. What the fuck is his name? <laughs> yes. Yes. Puts yeah. lotion on his skin unless it gets the hose in. Buffalo <laughs> Bill. <laughs> Buffalo Bill. That guy. What? 
Dallas you haven't seen it? You gotta, you, we gotta keep, we gotta, gotta catch you up. You gotta watch that one. We're gonna one. give you some one. courage juice. That's a classic. Whatever that may be. Yeah, just, just watch and it with a community. Like, You'll be fine. Yeah, I've mm-hmm. had like more nerves. And then we'll watch like adults. Family Guy afterwards or something, you exactly. know? No. No, because look, remember, and I say you a scary ass nigga. Don't take it first. I don't take it. But take it we would remember on uh on your birthday. Oh, when we was, it outside. was outside. And I was like, yeah. And she heard a noise. <laughs> <laughs> so I went to see in what the, the dark, noise was. In the dark. And she's like, you crazy. Why are you going over I there? I said, you're walking towards <laughs> the danger? <laughs> <laughs> Not away from the danger? Yes, the noises? It's, it's women. It's you nighttime. Like, I'm like, us. he's like, I said, did you hear something? He goes, yeah, I did. Then he gets up and starts walking towards the, the danger. And I'm like. What yeah, that's what I said. Want. There's coyotes and stuff out here, and he's like, Coyotes, I'll kick that. <laughs> <laughs> Coyote ain't gonna attack him. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, just saying, the only like, thing, like, if it's a bear, the only thing could be back there a, <laughs> a rat, rabbit. a rabbit, a coyote, a bobcat. Yeah. A bobcat, you, nothing you, you, that we a, bob, a bobcat is like 30 pounds. Yeah, they yeah. just think inside. Yeah. Do they attack I, people? I, I don't know. I, no, like but you would, I, don't? I'm sure if you backed in in a corner, yeah. But out in the open, your big he backyard, he just not yeah. gonna attack me. He gonna you don't go, want that. He gonna go back up. now. Like I said, if it was a little bear or something, <laughs> you never know. You I don't know, know what's in the house. We going in the house. Mama is close, man. <laughs> we going. Right, I don't know what's back there. Yeah. A coyote? What? I mean, we got it. But you know I just what? got attacked by a German Shepherd. I kicked the shit out of that dog. You think I'm? <laughs> yeah, I was very impressed. You think I'm afraid of a coyote <laughs> after a German Shepherd? Fuck out of here. I was like, but sometimes, I guess like, that's a good idea. To sometimes, <laughs> the freakiest shit ever. Oh my god! It was like it was maybe three o'clock in the morning. I was asleep, and all I heard loud as fuck was like yip yip yip. Oh, yeah. I mean, it was so loud. It sounded like a hundred coyotes. It was probably like 15, but it sounded like a hundred. And it was so loud that I swore they was like a <laughs> <my> back door. <laughs> I thought they was coming in. Like It was so loud. And I, I don't know how coyote coyotes are in packs. If they're more attacking of people in packs versus like, like hyenas, right? That one hyena ain't going to attack a lion, but in packs, have you, if you saw a pack of coyotes, you wouldn't be, I've never seen a pack of coyotes. I seen like four or five, like close to me, not too long ago. You seen five coyotes together? Together. They were together. Yeah. They were like, yeah. I'm, oh hell no! Nah, yeah, I've, I've only seen them solo, set. like oh, one at a time. I ain't Dang. never seen that like, either. Okay, you gotta hurry up and open the gate. I mean, my <laughs> nigga, I'm not gonna go after five coyotes. And that little noise we heard wasn't no five coyotes. That was sound like that sound like some rustling in the grass. Oh, the worst. <laughs> Get the fuck up out of there. It was more than likely it was a lizard. <laughs> to be no, do me like that, Kenny. <laughs> to be to be completely Carson honest, be eating the lizards. He ate two lizards. It sounded Go like ahead. you know when the lizards be moving in your uh-huh. little brush. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, nah. You know what other movie is really good that I thought was really good? Um, I think it was the last Texas Chainsaw Massacre that came out maybe in the early two thousands. The most he- see now he was very very aggressive. So I might think twice. <laughs> <laughs> he was, yeah, that Leatherface, and then they yeah. have actual like, they have actual like police footage that they show at the end, and I think those officers were like, <laughs> I don't think that was real. You know what I'm talking about? Steph, that no, was, <laughs> well, no, Steph. I'm just no, no. They made that for the movie, Steph. <laughs> what is the? Well, I thought you can't do that. <laughs> I thought you can't do Steph, that. that in, in in films, honestly, yeah. I thought you can't say that this is real footage from something that, if it's not, why would they tag it as that? I haven't seen it in a very long time, so I'm <laughs> right. not going to speak on it, but I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty right, sure. Right, the, the footage was kind of like in black and white and it was real grainy. Uh-huh, at yeah, the yeah, end? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They did that for the movie as well. For the, you know. I don't know. I think serious. that's your, I think that's your uh, conspiracy theory popping out. I don't know if what you're saying is actually true. How is that a conspiracy theory? 
because that's what you're saying, but I don't think that you don't think that's the reason they did it. You don't think that little part. Of no, it. she think it's real. You he, think I think that real. part of the movie was real because I believe that this story mm-hmm. <laughs> happened. <laughs> it's yeah. not like it's it's just a completely made up story out of nowhere. No, that the that stuff is real. I didn't dive deep into that franchise. So I don't know. Yeah. yeah. Just driving from Texas to, it's like Mm-mm. um so y'all know what they said the voodoo dolls really were as opposed to that voodoo shit they talk about where you crack it and break yeah. so they said the the witch doctors back then they would use the doll for their patients to tell them like to show them where the ailment was Oh, yeah, oh. where's the pain? So they will put pins like in it? Locator. Well, right. No, so it's like, here, I give you this, and now you tell me where it hurts. Mm-hmm. And that's why. So, like, if you point to the neck, so somehow now that shit didn't got misconstrued to, oh, if I take the voodoo doll and crack the neck, then that's why this nigga neck is going to break. Like, <laughs> it's like, nah, it was a whole nother method for that shit. It's so like you, they chart. So you don't almost. believe in witches? Wizard of Oz witches? Nah. Like it's not not I don't. around today. Not the animated witches of the movies where you throw water on them and they melt. Not not Fly, those. Flying on broom and shit. But sorcery, like witches who have spells, who, you know, practice a, it, there's a lot of it that goes on in Louisiana. Like Um, I believe they exists in that's what they call themselves but okay. I Yo, don't. not gonna lie when you go down there it is a different little energy down there motherfucker. I, I can I believe the For energy sure. is probably electrifying too how does it but did you say it was pleasant um I haven't been like just I don't know I guess too because it's like it is a south and it has so much old architecture so it's like it was a mixture of like Yo, they be practicing voodoo down here and like, oh shit, this was around during slavery. So it's just, like, it's real heavy. It's real heavy. The culture is heavy. Like, yeah, you know, especially coming from LA where it's like so mixed, you go down there, it's like, it's real. It's you think black about and white. like, <laughs> get out? Like. Yeah, it wasn't like that because most, I mean, it's so many black people down there. Right. Yeah. But just, you could, you know, you could I feel think it, like, of, basically, you know, when people be like, if these walls could talk, it's mm-hmm. like that. Like, I um, think of Eve's um, Bayou movies, um, and there was another movie, and I can't even think of the name of it right now because I just I've seen so many movies <laughs> it just jumbled. <laughs> but Megan Good was in it, and it was a. Uh, Did you say Eve's Bayou? Yeah, wasn't she? Yeah, she. Yeah, she's yeah but this is this is this is a different one. She's di- Megan Good is an adult. And then she's like in college and she has a white home girl that goes and plays as um, as a, a home care worker in this house. And they like ultimately use these this this spell to switch bodies so that she can be like younger. And it's oh, oh I've never seen that. I'll tell you the name of it so you can put you can put a caption or something Damn. on the video. But yeah, they're they're young. It's so good. Skeleton Key. Mm, I heard of it. I never seen Skeleton it. Key. I never heard of that. It's really good. Y'all got it. I liked it a lot. And it didn't it wasn't a publicized movie like that. I don't mm-hmm. think it had a huge marketing budget. But yes, the skeleton key is is very creepy. What make it horror? Like, what? Um, well, I don't. I, I guess I don't want to tell the end. <laughs> well, no, <laughs> but, I just. But it's they use voodoo. There's, uh, it's in the south. They use voodoo to take over, and there's these like old, old, old black families that they interact with. That's like ancestors that. Oh, damn. Right. Then that sounds interesting. That's enough. There's I get definitely it. like I candles. I get it. I get it. Mm-hmm. Salt right. candles, you know. Seances and seances. shit. Seances. It's like all mirrors, right. like all that stuff. Like it, it's, it, it, I liked it. Yeah, you guys should definitely check out the Skeleton Key. 
But yeah, so making good. Um, do we have um let's see. Do we have anything else that we wanna? Nah, I think we I think we good. Yeah, we covered okay. it all. Okay, well, y'all stay up, enjoy your Halloween. Um, be safe out there. Be safe out there. I don't know about going trick or treating and getting the candy and stuff from the strangers. I might, I might skip on, skip out on that this year. (laughs) Um, and even some haunted houses. Oh, before we go, did y'all hear about the the guy that worked at the haunted house who switched out? Uh, he brought his knife from home and he actually like stabbed. (laughs) somebody instead of the prop knives that they had like that they Why gave the workers that? and he accidentally like stabbed somebody <laughs> so be careful at these haunted houses that a that's delicious. the gym of the day <laughs> bring your own night no <laughs> gym of the day be careful at the haunted houses because some didn't bring real knives and weapons <laughs> to um <laughs> she didn't mean that y'all she does no I, be, uh, the, be careful, I said though. be careful be careful because yeah. That that is a real that's a real thing. Um, all right, y'all. Well, we're gonna get out of here. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. We hope you have a safe Halloween. Hit us up, 213-441-2112. If you have anything that you want to tell us, um, send us a text message, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Peace. Peace out. Stop, stop.